Hello, it's Ken with AMN. It's been a while, it's been some months now, and I felt like um, I'm slacking because I noticed on YouTube, if you type in adrenomyelineuropathy, my video from four years ago is number one. So I'm like the poster child here, and I, and I feel like I'm not doing a good job. But I'm back, I have AMN, as you all know. Um, this is my car. I think the last time we spoke, I talked to you and told you that I ordered a car. Well, the car came about months ago now, probably four months ago, give or take. Um, yeah, I love it. Best investment I've ever made. It's costing me every month, but it's nice, it's comfortable, it's everything that I wanted. Um, and neighbor, neighbor ladies waving at me, what's up? Uh, it's, it's what I wanted and yeah. And like, it was more of a, remember it was a YOLO and we do only go around once. But yeah, so there's that, uh, had a weird, um, I've been doing okay outside. My leg braces, ironically, have not broken. Um, I do own them now. I finally paid for them. I was making payments on the last one set I got. I do own both of them now. Um, I've been trying to be gentle with them. I haven't broke them. Did go down on my knee, you know, it's been almost a month ago now on a, a drunken stupor down onto my knee but it went down but I went onto um the uh, bathroom like a bathroom like rug mat so it wasn't horrible but it kind of it did some it did a duty on me especially trying to go up and down the steps at work so yeah that was and I honestly think with AMN and everything else too like the 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 healing of that takes a little bit uh, longer like honestly I feel like we can take more because like you know like tripping and falling is actually it's, it's it's more of a commonplace I would say now that I'm almost 38 um not outside outside again I'm good but like inside just random bleh, like the other day I was well my my um on the knee like uh, my calves I've been trying to do more stretching and everything too because I've been pretty stiff um I just, like, the knee, the butt, like, underneath my, I was actually, I guess it would be my calf, because it was underneath my knee. It, like, kind of, like, gave out, and there I was in the hallway, and my leg just gave out. I mean, where else are you probably going to go but down? And then when you're down, you laugh. But I'm actually getting really good at tripping and falling, because I know that I have to go down to my butt. So, yeah. So, that has been that, and then during the whole knee thing, that happened to be actually I was outside and I I had my backpack on this, so I went down like a turtle. I actually, opposed to going front where my braces would help me, I decided just to lose my balance and go back. That's actually happened to me twice in about the past year, so that's weird too. So it's like I need a pair of leg braces that go the other way, <laughs> uh, but those are just like everyday things but like in the grand scheme of it when i look at my whole situation like things could be a hell of a lot worse um so i'm grateful for everything that i do have and um yeah just trying to keep it gee i i keep it positive you got to keep it positive um mental health is important um absolutely and um yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't have it any other way, I would say. Mental health. Uh, indeed. Uh, and I do, I should, there should be a podcast actually coming out that I've recorded uh, through All Stripes. Um, I've verified it and they're soon, they should be soon publishing it within the next few weeks or so. So I'll definitely try to share it in a link in another video. So if you want to listen to that, um, I talk more about life in general. <sighs> but yeah, so it's just, yeah, I, I made another Ken with AMN video actually a couple weeks ago, but that's pretty much the whole thing it was. It was just, yeah, uh-huh, everything's great. Like, I say everything's great, but, you know, not everything's great. But I really, at the end of the day, you know, I can't complain so much. Um, I did have a kind of a fun, like, um, you remember how my urologist said I do have an overactive bladder? I don't think he's wrong some days, but then other days I don't. But the other day at work, well, that was actually a number two as well. Like they had, they had a plumbing issue and they had to shut off all of the bathroom. So you couldn't go to the bathroom. And I remember I was downstairs and I'm like, wow, I gotta go. And it was number two. And again, that's one thing with AMN. When you gotta go, you gotta go. And there's no, there's no holding it. So <laughs> off I went, I went 
probably about what it's like almost a mile or two down the road to Burger King and I like stumbled in there and I took care of business but I was like huh but the longer we thought about that we would have no bathroom I, I had to pee more than it too so I was like <laughs> Uh, because like it is that's the thing it is a thing like you gotta go you gotta go now and um um to to say i haven't had issues where i haven't made it in time would be a lie because again you gotta go you gotta go now but it's kind of one of those things it is what it is you, you clean yourself up and you move on you know it's like you know again it's not all rainbows and butterflies, but for the, oh, the overall grand scheme of things, I can't complain about um, my life now in June 2000. We're in summer 2022. So I hope to have hopefully more things to report, exciting things to report. I do go to Boston next month uh, for my yearly um, and the um, MIN 102 trial. Um, do all that testing. We'll be up there for three days, so it will be go up on a Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. But the Wednesday, I think, is just a go up trip. So hopefully, we can go up and hit the casino up. I think it's just me and mom that trip, probably. So I might get to hit lots of casino trips that time. So we we'll always keep the best things. Um, and that is just, just touching. I knew I wanted to touch somewhere with the mental health aspect of it. I've kind of, I don't know if I touched, I think I touched way back, but that was during my OG days when I first got the diagnosis on how I kind of went into like depression and I fed it with gambling, alcohol. Like gambling has always been a thing my adult life, but it was years ago, and I've mentioned on this channel before that like the online casinos and stuff they have in Pennsylvania that I can just open my laptop and off I go and lose my money. Um, I actually, I've gone through a couple phases through that where I actually told myself, no, I'm no longer playing, which I did fairly good with that, but like it became an addiction. So I did that and then, but then I found myself going back. So I literally won, I think I, last time I played, I won like $200. I went in and you can set deposit limits. So all of the casinos that I had joined, I changed the deposit limits to just $1 a month. And all of them, the minimum deposit is $10. So even if I wanted to play the dollar, I can't play the dollar. And like mental health, like I've literally cleansed my brain of that, of a, that was, it was a vice and it was not a good vice either. Again, I was just, there were times I just like, I, I over gamble gamble money that I I don't think I ever like officially hurt myself but I never I gamble more money than I had wanted to and again it, it took up more of my time too like I mean I've told this story on the channel before but like just in general with AMN and that was a good, good mental health choice so yeah you gotta take care of yourself but anyway, I'm Ked with AMN. I've met a lot of fun people um, just from these videos that have AMN. Um, get a hold of me here. Um, if you're another, if you're a former man, I'm going to say man, a male, um, we do have a Facebook group specifically for AMN men. Shoot me a message or you send me your email address and I can send you a link to it. It's on Facebook. Um, it's a good group of people. And we meet up, have monthly Zoom calls. Uh, it's a good support system. All right, Ken with AMN. Thanks for watching and keep those feet moving. See ya.